Hey everybody, in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to create charts and graphs in your ChatGPT conversations. Right, so if you want to create pie charts like this one, here is how to do it. So as you can see here, you have to use this ChatGPT plugin called the Diagram or Diagram. If you want to learn more about this ChatGPT plugin, I have a full tutorial on my website ryhex.com where I share some of the best use cases you can use this plugin for and some of the best prompts you can use this plugin with. And because you can use this to plot the growth of stock prices over time, create distribution of market share, visualize sales data and all that good stuff. And all of that you can do that inside ChatGPT. If you want to read this article, I will link the article URL in the description below so you can also check it out. And you can also get access to a complete database of all currently available ChatGPT plugins that can be installed from the ChatGPT plugin store. You can search this plugin database by category, plugin name, description, and get quick access to ChatGPT plugin video tutorials, the best use cases and prompts for all available ChatGPT plugins. The database can be downloaded for free, but you can also support the maintenance and the frequent updates of the database with a small donation. Any support is appreciated. You can get access to this database by using the link in the description below. All right, but now let's see how to create charts or pie charts in ChatGPT. So all you have to do is click on new chat. And right now you have to be a ChatGPT Plus subscriber and you have to enable plugins in your ChatGPT account to be able to create charts inside ChatGPT. If you have enabled plugins, all you have to do is select GPT-4 from the model selector, then select plugins. Then you have to click on this drop down arrow and first you have to make sure that this the iGram or Diagram ChatGPT plugin is installed. As you can see here, it's installed for me. If it's not for you, you have to click on plugin store here and install this plugin. Once the plugin is installed, all you have to do is enable the plugin by clicking the checkbox next to the name of the plugin. All right, now let's see a quick example on how to create charts with uh, ChatGPT. So for this example, I'm gonna use ChatGPT to create a pie chart for me. And I have found an article on the market share of decentralized crypto exchanges. So let's say we want to visualize this table on the market share of the several centralized crypto exchanges like Binance, Coinbase, Crypto.com, Upbit, Kraken. So if you copy this table here and go back to ChatGPT, all we have to do once the plugin is enabled is to paste the data here. So as you can see, it uh, doesn't save the table, but this is good enough for us because ChatGPT is clever. So don't worry about that. And besides the data, we also have to add some kind of description here, uh, some kind of prompt here. So ChatGPT will recognize that it has to create uh, pie charts here. So as you can read here, you can use really simple natural language. All I had to add is create a pie chart on the market share of the central crypto exchanges. Then click on generate here. And as you can see, you don't have to use any kind of function. ChatGPT is clever enough to know that if it wants to create a chart, it has to use this diagram ChatGPT plugin. And then if you click on this drop down arrow, you can see what is it doing. It uh, basically structures the data so the exchanges and their corresponding market share and using that data it will create a nice pie chart for us as we will see in a second so as you can see it has really done that so as you can see here's the market share of centralized crypto exchanges and this is a nice pie chart as it can be clearly seen binance is the biggest player currently on the centralized crypto exchange market and you can of course save this or download this image if you want to do that by clicking on save image as, or you can click on this uh, link here and also check out this interactive pie chart. So as you can see, you can click on these pies here. And of course, if it's a more complex chart, you can also interact with the chart in the diagram app, as you can see here. But all in all, this is how to create charts in ChatGPT. You can use this plugin to create line charts, bar charts, so not only pie charts, more complex charts as well. If you want to learn more about this ChatGPT plugin, I have other tutorials on my channel that you can check out. And not only on this plugin, but basically on I'm planning to make videos on all the most most interesting and most exciting ChatGPT plugins. So make sure to check out that on my YouTube channel. You can also check out great prompts in the article I have mentioned for using this ChatGPT plugin. And also, if you want to get access to the complete ChatGPT plugin database that includes categories, searchable descriptions and more, you can also find the link to that in the video description below.